in the World Championships. Doesn't that sound good to them? Runners up in the Europeans this year. Of course, they were champions last year. This is 29-year-old Isabel Delabel and 30-year-old Olivier Schoenfelder. We don't want to lose pictures of them because the setup is all part of the routine. Now this is a Celtic country dance from uh, Brittany in the north of France. And remember this is the first year we can use props. The scarves are just that, beautifully incorporated into this routine. Seamless into the straight line step sequence. change it's the rise and fall on the knee and in depth in the ankle A fantastic ending. Technically, you've got to admire it. It didn't get the crowd behind them. Not like some of the performances that we've seen, but uh, nevertheless, no real mistakes in there. Just, I don't know, Nikki. To me, something was missing in that. It just seemed flatter than it, I remember from the Europeans. It did seem a little flatter than Europeans in the middle of the straight line step sequence. I just would love to see it again. Tiny touch off balance, perhaps, with the hands above the head on the first set of twizzles from Olivier but, uh, and I was I was left wondering about the comparison on the spin against the Canadians who had at least three changes of position in the spins as did the Russians so some of those elements not having the degree of difficulty as some of the competitors that have gone before them just on that one for sure but the use of the props, very clever indeed. The, the lift in particular where she's balanced and he's holding her by the, the scarves, that works so well. Taking something and creating something new. That's what I always love in ice dancing. Here is that move, balancing on the boot. Hands can't be above the head, just on line. Very difficult. As ever, look, we talk about rise and fall on the knee and the ankle. Can you see it? You rise and then you fall, you push down to get the change. You rise up for the turn, so you rise as you turn and then bend 
coming down to push round on the edges. And if you get that technique right, it's like a skier. You can generate loads of power without even changing feet. It's called a power pull. A power pull? That's what it's called. I didn't know it was called a power pull. Yeah, that's what it is. Oh, I love sitting next to you. I learned so much. Oh, no. Got to earn a keep somehow. A power pull. Okay, just to uh, put you in the picture, the Russians lead. Canada second, Italy in third. But in fact, uh, the Italians are fourth on the afternoon. The Americans have closed the gap slightly on the Italians. So. And there's a wonderful quality in their presentation, the way they create the overall routine and then relate to each other too. Good technical scores. Certainly good. 35.367. 0.25 the score for Isabel Delabel and Olivier Schoenfelder. That will give them 107.98. So they increase their lead. A new season's best for them, yes. and there it is, yes. number one, Delabel Schoenfelder.